Hi, this is Natalie from Looming for Life, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make the Dragon Scale bracelet on your fingers, because I don't know how to make it on the loom. And let's, for this tutorial, you only need four fingers. Some people can do this Dragon Scale on a fork. I have no idea how they do that. And a lot of people know how to do it on the loom. But today I'm going to be showing you how to do the most unique one on your fingers. But let's get started. So, you're going to take one band, you're going to take your four fingers, and you're going to take this band and loop it around your middle two fingers in an X. Or figure eight, if you would like to call it. And then you can take another band, make an X on your index and middle finger. Then take another band, do an X on your ring finger and pinky. Then you're going to turn your hand around so that the palm. Your palm is facing away from you. Then you're going to take your bottom band in the middle and you're going to bring it over your finger. Do the same on the other side. So then you can stretch it like this. Then you're going to take another band and you're going to stretch that normally across your middle two fingers. Then turn the finger and turn your hand away and bring your bands over. Stretch it and it should look like this. Then you take you want me to two get, rubber bands. Want me to get cocoa or sugar or something? And then take one band and bring it across these two fingers normally. Take another band and do the same thing on the other side. And then bring that bottom band over in the middle, like we've already done before. Now here is the different part. I'm going to take the palm that's facing away from you, but I'm not going to do that because I'm showing you. I'm going to take this bottom band on your pinky, bring it over. On a band on your index finger, and it should look like this. It's starting to look like a dragon scale. Take another band and put it around the middle, and loop the bottom two. Bands. Then go to take these two bands, two bands, loop them around your outside fingers and you're going to bring the middle bottom ones over the top and you're going to bring over bottom one on your pointer finger bottom one on your pinky so it should look like this as you can see I've already made one dragon scale for this video I'm only going to make a ring because um, I don't want to get any problems. Yeah. If you can, can you guys comment in the comment box how we can make our videos longer without having mishap. Anyway, take one band and bring it over these two middle fingers. Turn it over. Bring the bottom one over the top. And the bottom one over the top. It should look like this. It is starting to look like a dragon skin. Take two bands, bring them over the side of your hand, and bring the bottom ones in the middle over, and the bottom ones on the side. I will be showing you how to end this bracelet. One second. Alright, now I'll be showing you how to end this bracelet. This is a ring. Well, 
pretty much just like a little keychain. But you can bring your pink, the one, the band on your pinky, and bring it over to your ring finger. Bring the one on your pointer, pointer finger, or to your middle finger. Then you're going to take the ones in your middle finger. And you're going to put them on your ring finger. Then you're going to spread those two apart. I like to do it with my thumb. So, like this. Grab a C clip or an S clip. Wait, no, not yet. Put take one band, loop it through those four bands so that you don't have as much weight on your shoulders. Not exactly weight on your shoulders, but you know what I mean. Take an S clip and put it Stretch these two, these bands, and put the S clip here, and put, and stretch it out, and get your, your capping C clip thing, and okay. Now, it's not going to look very much like a dragon scale if you just do a ring, but if you keep repeating that pattern, it will start to look like this, the dragon scale. That was your tutorial on how to make a dragon scale bracelet. I hope you liked this video. Please subscribe and follow us on Instagram at Looming for Life. Bye!